today on EA TV. Join us soon. Hi there again, everybody. Martin Tyler along with Alan Smith for your commentary today on this match, which is going to have an extra factor to it, the heavy rain that's been falling. Yeah, the ball is going to skid across the surface. I did used to like these kind of conditions because you get one or two mistakes. If you're on your toes, it's one or two goals about for strikers. A team with awful home facts and figures, the worst home record in the league. Actually, they're facing the best away team in the league. Looks a mismatch on paper, on the pitch it might not be. Well, if you're the visitors, you've got to make the most of this poor home record and get the home fans worked up and frustrated so that it works in your favour. Now you've got your chance to check on the lineup for the home team. Well, we put it up, and what looks, Alan, very defensive, but there's flexibility, isn't there, in the side? Yeah, and I think with the shape, so much depends on the wing backs, how much they are allowed to get forward and what they can do when they do get forward. Barcelona's lineup here. Ivan Rakitic plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. We'll see how the striking option works with just one up front. A lot of build up. Finally, we're underway for the game itself. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. And a goal! How did he reach that? Brilliant goalkeeping. On behind for a Barcelona corner. That's a fine shot, an even better save. The ball did move in the air a touch, so he had to keep his concentration. Goalkeeper rising to the occasion, literally. Yeah, he would have been disappointed to get beaten, but nevertheless had to keep his eye on the ball. He's put in the corner. Saw the goal and went for it. They've broken through here with a really good goal and the celebrations reflect that the supporters are going crazy it's a terrific moment for the team a goal of a top class really here you see it happens so many times where the corner is a disappointment he hits the first man not that time He's not the easiest of managers to work for, I know that, but these players are doing what he demanded beforehand now. No great shocks then to see Barcelona ahead. Stuani. Mojica. Gets his cross in. Should hit it now. Well, against all the odds, they've got an equaliser here. Well, can you believe it? I certainly didn't see that coming. You have to be there to score it, and he ran in and got his reward, just couldn't miss. No, it was a poacher's effort. The final finish wasn't difficult, but to get there, it took a little bit of instinct. Well, this is brilliant stuff. Barcelona at their best, top of the league. Yeah, it's the position that we expected them to be in, but they fulfilled all those expectations and uh, thrilled us with some wonderful football. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. They've got the ball back, Barcelona. Brenner. 
Well, this is Barcelona, Alan. A formality? Well, you would imagine so, and they are used to coping with these situations. He's got his shot off now. Tried to find the winning ticket in the raffle, but a couple of numbers short. Yes, he took it early, though. The visiting team were very, very big winners the last time these two teams met. But no two games of football are ever the same. And, of course, this one isn't in the same stadium. No, and quite an intimidating atmosphere here. The crowd anxious not to see a repeat, so it will be tough for them. Going forward well. Teammates arriving for the cutback here. He's blocked the shot well. And the goalkeeper with a textbook save and keeps the ball in his grasp. That's his game, isn't it? Intercepting. Looking for an opening with some good control builder. Shots on here. Corner now for Barcelona. Corner swung in, strong punch from the corner by the keeper. Now this is an interesting attack. Rakitic. Kenna. Home team have some work to do, Alan, because they've lost their last two games. They've got home advantage, they, they need to win today. Yeah, they do, put a pressure on them in front of their own fans, but uh, I fancy them to do it here, actually. Good defensive clearance there. Sergio Busquets. Strange game at the moment, the attacking team having all the ball, but not really making many chances because the opposition are defending in numbers. Kenna. And now the shot! Corner then for Barcelona. Well, they've created chance after chance. They need some ruthlessness now. Corner's taken. They've scored! And they've gone into the lead! And undoubtedly deserved. They have been by far the superior side, and they really imposed their will on the opposition. Too good, really, for the defending. And the shot in the end, far too good for the goalkeeper. Barcelona have put the ball in the net. Well, the uh, attention to detail from the coach on these kind of set pieces He's faultless, he'll be delighted with that. Let's see the replay now. Well, it's been tight before that goal, but now the manager, he's so pleased because I reckon he feels his team can go on and win this. Barcelona then with the lead. Duani. Getting forward well as a team now. Mojica. It goes out wide again. Well, that's good defending. Rolf. Just a case of finding the spare man is always available in their own half and the opposition letting them do this at the moment, although they are trailing. And here's Messi in his wide areas where he's such a danger. Busquets, and he gives it back to him. Kenna. And shoots! And they have scored! And they do lead now by two. And 
they've worked very hard for this. It should get them across the line at the end of the match, we'll see. One more look at what happened earlier. Could the defender have done anything different, Alan? Well, maybe he's half turned away, and that didn't help. If he'd have closed it down a bit more bravely, it might have been better. Won the scoreline as we restart the game. Daniel Schwab played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. I think uh, any football fan will say, when the rain comes down like it's coming down now, it's going to add to the thrills, a few spills possibly. Well, it normally does, doesn't it? And I always used to like it because uh, it quite often meant you got a few more chances in the box with the. Uh, Bounce the ball and what have you. Patience is the name of the game at the moment. That's out of danger there with that clearance. Brenner. Oh, it's a corner. Why that deflection? What an organiser of this team. He's in great form. One of those games where he's just been pulling all the strings and it's one thing having possession, but it's another thing doing something positive with it. And he's certainly done that with his uh, assist today. But here comes the corner. Cleared away by the defender. And this is a good opportunity to put the ball into the penalty area now. Eklund. Kenner. Has a go here. Goalkeeper can only parry it out. To throw in for Barcelona. That save, you know, we've just seen, it could go down as the save of the season. It was that good. Real opening now. Oh, that's such a classy goal. And that's the third, the hat trick. It's a day he'll never forget. They will be signing the match ball for him afterwards because of a hat trick. Yeah, he won't forget this day in a hurry. Top stuff from him. Oh, he's loving it, the manager. He's seeing his team playing really well, just what he was asking for. I don't think we expected this. Such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Duani. Defended well. Corner coming up. So there'll be a good chunk added on. It's going to be four minutes. There was danger, but he's cleared it. Sergio Busquets. Kenner. a chance for a better through ball there and that will be the keepers it's half time here we're at half time Barcelona have got the lead it looks as though there's every chance of them continuing this excellent away record but still second half to come well we've seen why they've been able to be so successful on the road so good at counter-attacking Put in the corner. Saw the goal and went for it. 